Yo, what's up, guys? International O back at it with another one, man. I'm, I'm, I, I had some few shoes in this week, so I'm trying to get these all knocked out. I got another pair downstairs that I gotta go pick up and do a review of probably today. So I'm doing three videos a day, but you guys will see them over time, um, based on maybe urgency or however you know we'll get it done. But today, yes, this shoe, man. It has been an adventure trying to get this shoe. I initially lost out on sneakers app for the draw for the shoe. Okay, no problem. Got a notification from the Travis Scott website. Shoe went live. I clicked the link. I purchased. I checked out successfully. No problem. Then I got a cancel order. I'm like, well, why did I get canceled? Well, they went from first come first serve online to raffle. So that mean they so they said my order was fraudulent and they canceled my order. And I saw a few other people actually um get their orders canceled, but not even that. Some people actually won the raffle and when they clicked the link it said sold out. So somehow people got a hold of their link with a bot and checked out. So it was a disaster, man. It was a it was a disaster of a release. And then on top of that, we didn't get a pair here in the city, even though that Travis Scott is from here. Foot Locker did LA only. Travis is from here. So, on to the shoe. Here we go. You see the box. Yes. Travis Scott Jordan 6s. I was able to get my pair from, of course, the app. And man, let me look. Look, Trey Block. If, if you've seen this, let me talk to you guys. I've been, I've been showing some love, mad love, to the Trey Block app on my YouTube channel and online. Holla at your boy, man. Let's 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 get something worked out. Let's do some business, man. Payroll or something. Let's get some business going. Got this courtesy of the Trade Block app. I traded in my Hyper Royals because they are a size 14. I could not wear them, and people were acting like they didn't want to trade. So I traded a pair of Hyper Royals and a pair of Yeezy 350s. I think it was to get this pair because I wanted this shoe, and I got it. No complaints. Let's get to it. You open it, the bag. First thing you see, the drawstring backpack. Here on one side, you see the Jordan logo. On the other side, Cactus Jack. You know what it is. Beautiful box, beautiful packaging. This shoe is gorgeous, man. The Jordan 6 Travis Scott. This shoe is beautiful. This is a beautiful shoe. I have no complaints about this shoe. This I like the suede on here. Like I said, for me, I like that, like the rough vintage suede material. I like that. I know some people are trying to compare these to those uh, brown uh, sixes that came out a while back, wheat or whatever. Not even close. You can try to make you, you know, to to, to make it feel good about yourself. If you got a pair to justify it, it ain't close. Let's see, got the pockets. Yeah, I heard the pockets had lace lock. So you got an infrared lace lock in this one, in this pocket here. Um, but the shoe also come with clear lace locks as is. I think the lace lock glows in the dark too, just like the sole and the tongue of the shoe and this heel tab. These, this, the tongue, the heel tab, and the sole all glows in the dark from what I was told. And you see at the bottom, it says Travis Scott backwards you guys can see that here on the sole of the shoe and it has the the little logo the little i guess it's the cactus jack logo and then it says yeah it says the cactus jack logo here then it has the face the smiley face this is i like the detailing of this shoe this is a date this is a nice shoe the detailing of it is on point it got they and they put a lot of cactus jack branding on here because it's cactus jack branding here on the inside i don't know if you guys be able to see that but in here on the inside is the cactus jack branding and then you have it here on the back of the shoe and you have the logo right here like they they may he made sure you know this is his shoe then here i like this here they have these little tags right here where you can put it in there Put your finger in there, man. This is this is a nice shoe. I like this shoe. This this, this is tough. Cause when I seen it, I'm like, man, you know, it's cool. I like sixes, man. But you know, if I don't get it, I can do without it. But then the more I start looking at pictures when people got them in hand of this material, I was like, yeah, 
yeah, I think I might have to pull the plug. So, you know, it took me some working on trade block. I was originally trying to get some dunks, and that didn't work out. So I went on after these, and I was able to secure them. I was able to secure my path. So no complaints here, man. But the quality of this shoe, and it comes with two laces also. It comes with like a dark brown lace, and then it comes with some infrared laces. I've seen people use these laces, and I think they actually look nice with these laces. The brown ones are dope, but I think with this being brown here, I think this won't set it off as right. So I will maybe go with, with the infrared or the hot pink uh, laces on the shoe. And of course the air unit is, I'm guessing it's hot pink or infrared. Either one, you know, let's see what it say on the box. Cause I'm thinking infrared. It, uh, bright crimson is what they call it. So bright crimson air unit tab. Then here on the heel of the shoe, it says Nike Air. Then the Jordan logo, it's all bright crimson. Uh, every time I see that color, I just think infrared, but as they call it, bright crimson. Then you have your pockets and the, and the two pockets. You have a zip pocket and then a pocket with a button. So, you know, whatever you want to put there, you can put it there. So uh, that's pretty much it, man. I just wanted to show this shoe off, man. This is a thing of beauty. I love this shoe. I, I was hesitating and I'm like, man, after I struck out, I was like, eh, forget it. I can do without it. But I'm glad I went ahead and copped it. Um, this is a dope shoe, man. Shorts. Like usually I don't go buy outfits and tell people what to wear with, man. Because I'm not going to lie. Like I like Jordans, but I've been kind of shying away from high top Jordans a lot lately. Um, that's why I've been getting a lot of threes and fours. Of course, ones are classics, but sixes are more of a big bulky shoe. Like sixes and fives are a little bulky. Um, but this is a dope shoe. Summertime, shorts, you can pull it off. I was against it at first, but yeah, summertime with the right shorts, you can pull these off. You can pull these off. I'm going to do this on feet with the shorts I got on. They might not match, but this is just what I got on because these are the shorts I just got on today. But yeah, the right pair of shorts, man, this is set it off. I personally, me personally, wouldn't probably wear this with jeans, maybe in the winter time if I wanted to pull it out, but I would definitely rock these with shorts in the summertime just to show off the complete detail of the shoe. That's just me, my opinion, take it as you wish. But enough of that, man, let's get to the on feet.